was as you see there are news coming on that there is an impeding pandemic which we can expect in the 2023 as lab owners and people who are starting the laboratory new you need to be prepared of what is going to come first thing that could be a surge in patient load to your laboratory so your laboratory space has to be prepared to tackle that second thing how you are going to tackle your patients they will be having so much of doubts they will be having so much of clarifications you need to also deal with them and the third thing how you are going to protect yourself all these three things are very important to prepare yourself as a whole to compete in this laboratory market during this period. The first one preparedness of your laboratory make sure you have all the stocks in place because like you know in the last pandemic during the second wave there was an acute shortage of gloves and you know the aprons and everything so you have to make sure you have adequate stock of them if you're going to buy only after there is a surge in patients then the price is really going to be very high instead don't stock too much but at least be prepared what you can expect in the next 6 months by analyzing the next one week itself second thing how you going to deal with your patients patients will have lots of doubts they will come and say that i am having fever should i do an rt pcr i am having sore throat i traveled recently so what are the uh, questions they will be asking you and how you are going to deal with them so anybody who is coming with any fever symptoms this is a winter season you will be having a lot of dengue cases along with that start also doing rt pcr so that your community is also protected with patients who have mainly sore throat and fever third thing how you going to protect yourself the most important part of this video in the first wave if you see there was a lot of casualties in the frontline workers we are frontline workers being a laboratory owner being a diagnostic center owner we are the frontline workers and we are directly exposed to the community which is infected so you have to make sure you wash your hands regularly have good mask you do not use your you know disposable masks more than once a day and if you are taking any positive cases of course sanitize your entire laboratory premises immediately and make sure before you go home you take a bath and then you know you go and mix with your family members any of your family members have any small symptoms don't hesitate to take an rt pcr so that even anything you know our uh, always our medicine practices when you are dying diagnosing diagnosing anything early we can of course have a very better cure rate that is what is for this also this pandemic also when you are diagnosing very early then of course we can bring the person back to a normal life very early this is what i want to give you through this video be confident be safe and be prepared to face the impeding situation of pandemic bye bye signing off to lalita sir